Hello there, I am Dr. Camacho. Did you know that many, if not most people are miss spraying nasal medications? I'm gonna show you how to do it properly. Instead of squirting the medication straight back, what you wanna do is aim towards the ear on the same side. For example, right nostril, right ear, left nostril, you aim for the left ear. If you squirt the septum, which is in the middle of the nose, which you can see in the illustration, it's going to dry the septum and potentially cause bleeding over time. The way I like to do it, and many other people like to do it, is you shake up the bottle, wipe it with alcohol. Right hand, I'm aiming it in the left nostril towards the left ear. Switch hands, left hand, aiming towards my right ear when it's in the right nostril. That's going to help maximize the medication because it's going to hit those turbinates which are swollen and over time it's going to shrink them. It can take many, many weeks. So you want to use a medication every day, even if you feel like it's not doing anything. Follow the instructions of your healthcare provider. If you're trying to aim for the sinuses, let's say you have chronic sinus disease. In that case, what you want to do after you spray is you go to your bed, lie down with your head kind of hanging upside down for a few minutes. That'll let the medication go upwards into the sinuses and give you that maximum benefit. If you just squirt straight back, some of the medication might make it up there, but most of it's going to go straight back over the turbinates and kind of go to the back of your throat. And what you want to do if you have sinus disease is hang your head upside down for a few minutes to let the medication get to those crevices and the sinus openings to help decongest it and decrease inflammation. Anyway, I hope this quick health tip was beneficial to you. Have a good day. Bye.